so full disclaimer i do not know most of the names because i mean i do know their names i just don't know how to pronounce them and i still do not know the names of those one cards and what's up guys today we are going to be doing a video of my setup let me get that out the way so we got the nice light the background stuff like that um so this is the tripod that we hold our camera on for future videos we have a very nice light like jellyfish thing helps for distraction i also do some other stuff here wristband to fiddle with and we're coming back here kind of a mess you know just just casual anyways sit down and yeah but let's not show those y'all are i'm just playing anyways these are my pokemon shoes so we can get ready to uh get our stuff on and this is our first section right here for like all my lights shades code cards um, that I will be giving out. I actually have a lot that I've saved leading up to this. Um, this is interesting, I guess. I don't know. Uh, I forgot what this was. Oh, yeah. So this is like a, um, a... It's a chart for Pokemon. Specifically Scarlet and Violet. And here's like the type disadvantages of um, all the Scarlet and... No, this is not Scarlet and Violet. This is just a Scarlet move set level stuff like that. Um, yeah, those are what those are for. And as we might be playing, we have Pokemon Violet and Scarlet, which I've already beat Scarlet, but will be replaying on the channel. Um, I don't know if I should do a side gaming channel. My light right here, shining down all my stuff. So, um, actually, let's get these out. This is my first collection. It has no sleeves, it's kind of bad binder behavior, but we will be getting into this. Of course, I got Chimander. Um, I got a binder, some other good stuff down there. Learn that out for the next video. All right, let's get into this first. Okay. And what's up? And anyways, so we're getting into this tin right here. Um, I already took the cards out um, over here. You can see the little corner of them, stuff like that. Um, so we're going to get into the little coin collection first, you know. Um, so these are used for like TCG. Um, oh, these are used for like TCG. Um, this is a grunky coin, you know. Like you flip them heads or tails, it does damage. Very nice. Um, then we have this very nice Lycanroc, which is one of my favorites, actually. Um, Lycanroc is one of my favorite, especially the night one. I think this might be Dusk. I don't like Dusk, even though it's a rare one. I prefer the dark type um, one. Then we have him, which I don't, uh, him or her, or the Pokemon, which I don't actually know the name of, but, or I can't pronounce the name. I know the name. It starts with a Y. Then we have this nice Venusaur one that I actually got with a Venusaur V that I do not have no longer in my collection because I sold it. I have another one that I got from a Galarian bird pack. Um, I could give this away for a giveaway. It's probably only like a dollar, maybe. Something even less. But, yeah, part of the little collection here. Um, we are going to start off with the only fairy type I have in this current little box. So this box here, this little Chimander thing, you could get it like Dollar Tree. Probably not, actually. Like Dollar General, Walmart, Target. And it held that giant stack of cards right here. And this is like my first ever set, probably. Actually, no, I have a lot of old binders that I'm going to be getting out of my storage from my mom. Um, but other than that, yes, guys, we are going to get started with the first Pokemon being uh, Tepig. Or Tepo, however, however y'all say this. This is actually a debatable name, in my opinion, because of the proper English stuff. Oh, and... That really nice jellyfish thing, our brand for like fiddling. Nice setup, yeah. So, next is Heracross. Um, decent art, you know, basic grass type. Next, we have Yamega. So, we are going to go through literally every card. Yamega, unless it's a duplicate or something like that, like that, duplicate. Yama. You know, nice art, you know, if y'all like them, stuff like that. Nice back. Bam. Another Yama. Found that important. 
a skip loom rapid strike very nice you know decent car um my let me fix this light real quick because i feel like it's just shining the wrong way yes to highlight the rest of my desk i'm gonna get a pokemon that here make it look more professional a ladybug not a ladybug a ladybug same pokemon oh and we're dropping cards it's okay though um throughout the video if you could spark the the code cards will be nah i'm gonna be giving code cards out and stuff like that for another video it's gonna be like a specific code card video because i have a lot of them and on to one of my other favorite Pokemon, which is Oddish. Well, he's not my favorite Pokemon, but this nice, like, woven art. What's it called? Yarn. It looks very nice and detailed. Let me get it nice and close, you know. The weed Pokemon. Um, sorry for this little background noise. Grabbing a snack. No, I'm not going to. Skippedo. This is the, um... Unevolution or pre-evolution of Go Goat, which I have somewhere in here. Another Scapito, um, another Scapito, which I actually do have a lot of Scapitos for no reason, and only have like one Go Goat. Then we have a C dot, very basic art, just just C dot as Ram. Um, a Tacky Wacky or Thacky, the Wacky. Um, yeah. I also have a Rumbolian. I have their entire evolution line because I got the Rumbolian box with the Hollow, which will we will be seeing later. Then we have a Dernimus. So I actually don't know how to pronounce all these names. A lot of white meat, if you could see that. Um, very used and the evolution of Oddish Gloom. A lot of people like Dark Gloom or like the shiny version in like games. It looks pretty cool to me too. Um, a Dweebyul, or Dweebyul, very nice, I like this, Hermit Crab Pokemon, I actually had a Hermit Crab, Ram, you know, background, pretty nice, fix this deck over here, da -da -da -da. a Durant, Durant, nah, I feel like this should be a Steel and Grass, which I think it is in games, or like a normal, because of what it is, then we have a single strike pincier very nice i like like see the little like thing it's holding that's in it almost looks like like an electric kamiamiha or something if you know what i mean um then we have a glossal flower not the best a eldie gross which is an absolute one shot in any game especially the dynamax version in uh sword and shield which I cannot remember the trainer's name right now. But yes. Oh, there it goes. Go Go. I really like Go Go. He's not one of my Go Go. Go Go. But he's not one of my favorites. He's just a cool Pokemon. A Mark Cactus. Green Pants Edge. A Pet Lil. Pet Lil. Another Gloss of Flower. Krikatoon, very nice Krikatoon, um, I actually like him, like if you see his little stash right there, boom, 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 he got a little mustache, I feel like he's fancy, or even the white girl ones I think have a mustache, which is hilarious in my opinion, because why, or it's like a design or something, I don't know, then we have a shaman, which we, if you saw earlier, we have a Pokemon Go thing, and you can get those from certain events, which I cannot remember the names of right now. Um, we're about to get into the water pipes in a second because I actually have a lot of those. Um, all right, let's dive in. Boom, 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 boom. I gotta get them off the top there, make sure I ain't got no fighting types in there. And we have a snow runt, snow runt, snow runt, whatever. We have a piplup, or prince, prince lup. Piplup is the first one. One of my first ever Pokemon cards, actually. I'm pretty sure that this is from Evolutions, the double star me. It's really messed up. Um, 
It's really dirty, too. Um, like, if you can see that, that's really bad, guys. Um, forgive me for this card, RIP. But hey, hey, it's one of my first cards. I should actually sleeve that. I'm going to put that in my binder. I'm not letting you see that in the binder. Mm. Even though it's not the best card. Bergmite, which, um, aka, because how big this thing is. Do you know that in real life this thing's like, uh, it's bigger than four feet. This thing's like an iceberg, for real. And so is a Legendberg. Now this typing kind of confused me. Confused me? Confused me? Whatever, guys. Palo Slime. Why are you a water type? Like, I feel like you're fighting because you have Stampede. But you could also be a, uh, actually don't know. But I don't feel like it should be water. I feel like, I feel like Pokemon cards should have an ice type because Glaceon is also a water type, which is, or do they have a, do they have a, do they have a, I don't know guys. No, I don't think they do because this is like snow. Alolan Volapuk, oh, whoa. Alolan Volpix. Like, this is definitely a snow Pokemon. Like, for sure. Cryolagov, definitely snow Pokemon. But it's a water type. So that's what makes me feel like Galatian is also a water type. But, 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 but. Hold on, one second, guys. I have to grab my book. Pokemon Handbook. Nice holographic letters. Stuff like that. Nice, nice, nice. We're trying to get to the types. There are 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18. 18 types. And Bug does not have one. Rock. Ice. Ground. Ghost has one? No, Dragon. Hmm. The point is, there's no Ice type. Or Ground type. But, whatever. Back into the cards. Lapras. Slender. Sl Whoa. Shellender. Shellender. See, I know the names. Shellender. Hold on, guys. One second. Back. Shellender. Rapid strike. Um, no whiting. This is a new one. A Feebas. Also rapid strike. Double rapid strike. And I like how it has other shelters in the back. Hold on, let me put this card down. I like how it has other shelters, like, in the background. Like, look. Shellender, Shellender, Shellender. Now, imagine if it had a... Uh, bro, I cannot remember his name right now. Hmm, that's crazy. I also like this Mudkip because it also has another Pokemon in the back, which is the Sandcastle Pokemon. I cannot remember the name of... See guys, I'm I'm a little rusty. It's been a minute since I've really went through these cards. Cla cast form, snowy form. My personal favorite is actually the normal type, like the just normal cast form. Um, a Chulet. I love turtle Pokemon, so this is absolutely look snapping Pokemon. It's a snapping Taito. Turtle. Glaceon. I knew I had a Glaceon. Oh my goodness, Pokemon, if you ever watch this, we need a ice type. We need a ground type, too. I'm going to make a poll about this. Look, Glaceon is literally a water type. If y'all just saw in the book, he was literally the icon of ice. Or she, he, whatever. Fresh snow Pokemon. Snow. It's okay. They're going to make it one day, guys. And the last Pokemon is another Bergmite. This, uh, this like looks like kind of in the background. I don't know what this is from, but this definitely looks like the Pokemon Scarlet, um, Rhyme Battle. Like, like, that's that's what that reminds me of. That background. 
Um, next is fighting types. Um, and I have a lot of them. I have a really, really large amount, but most of them are devils. Hitmonchan. We're going to go through these decently quick. Sand True. Um, Rock Ruff. This is one of my favorite, like, arts because what? Look how cute that is. Imagine if that was y'all dog. Like, just, just imagine. Anyways, this. Why? You are a dragon. Galagar. Galagar. However you say his name. Claydol. A new Gen 9 Pokemon. Phalanx. 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 Whatever. Solar Rock. Wooper. Definitely a water type. Okay, Pokemon. Calm down. Finding type. Sulk. I don't have the other one. But I love him. Like, who doesn't want a Kung Fu fighting karate Pokemon? Hit. Whoa. Metachan. I'm trying to organize these over here in the corner. This video is probably going to be longer than 20 minutes, but who cares? Right on. Ride. I meant right horn. Another one. But see, this is a different art. Well, it's an art. Right on. Rock and Rolla, rocking his way into the um pile. So this and this came together. This normal dusk form lightning rock came with this. Pretty cool when you have the matching ones, which we'll also get into in a second. Palace wine. I knew I had another one. Y'all remember earlier when I said palace wine is not a water type. This is also one of my other first ever Pokemon. Palaswan is definitely a fighting type. It could be something else too, but it's not a water. It could dang near be an ice. Another Rhydon, which I don't need to show, which is in really bad condition. It's okay though. Sorry, Pokemon. Shuckle. Dang, this is new. It looks like it must have came with widening. Rock Ruff, again, different art though. It's called a puppy Pokemon. I've never noticed that. Focus. Puppy Pokemon. Another Shantru. Different art. Also one of my other first Pokemon. Rhyperior. So I have the entire evolution line of that. Crazy. And Carcool. I like that Pokemon. The other one is better. Beware. Y'all ever have y'all ever watched like the original anime when Team Rocket always gets swooped up by these and he goes and feeds them berries? Nostalgia is crazy. Um, next we're getting into a nose pass, always pointing north, you guys know, then to put them over here. No, I'm just playing. Then we have a, a route two Raul's, which Raul's, whoa, Raul. I love Lucario. I have two of these, which are decent. I just moved through fighting types almost efficiently fast. Then I barely have any, um, hold on guys. Oh, I have to remember the name of this type. Oh. See, I'm still rusty. You have to give me a chance. Physic, physic, physicus, whatever, I don't care. Esper, I have two of those. No point in showing them both. Uh, Cutie Fly, also have two of those. Doesn't matter. Meow Stick. Meow Stick. Routes. Oh my. Oh my. This art is beautiful. Have y'all ever saw this? This card, if, oh my goodness, if it has like an EX, the art would be beautiful. A toe bag. See, I have one of these that are a fairy type, and it's my only one. A toe bag, but it's a phys physicist type. Wow, the fat single strike. Another one of my nostalgic memories. Um, this one is actually about to be another really nice art. They shop it. Like, look at the red roofs. Look at, like, the background. He looks like a ghost, just like, he looks huge. Like, most Pokemon look huge, but he looks, like, massive. Like, look at that building. Look at him. Huge. A Mercily. A Mischievous. Palo Sand, which I also have a fighting type of this. That little Pokemon in the corner was when it was in the back of the Mudkip. 
Haunter. Hedadini. Hedadina. Whatever. Hedadina. Shump it again, but another really nice art. And Gasly. That looks like a cartoon almost, you know. Um, what's next on the chopping block for presentation? So, um, I only have a couple more, like, categories, because I have the, I'm really, like, Yamper, Plusle, stuff's falling, guys, because I've not had these out in a minute. All right, let me reorganize this. Look at Plusle, admire, admire Plusle. Anyways, Plusle, another one of my first cards, pretty beat up, but hey, doesn't have any grips and tears. A Tay Namo, Flaffy. I actually like this evolution line because it goes from a sheep to a pink one. Who does not like pink? Another Flaffy. A Vault of Warp, Joltik, Chin Chong. Chin Chong, Evolve Art, very nice art, single strike. Hit low pile, it's gold, it's, it's like solid gold. Luxio and Arphasios, or Arphasios, whatever. You guys know, you guys know the names, I don't. It's okay though, we're gonna just keep going. So, how was y'all's day today? I feel like I'm talking a little too much, but hey, Pokemon, it's not really an opening. Okay, I'm done. I'm almost done. Like, I'm really close because I'm not doing all my energies. We're just going to zoom through this real quick. Okay. Zora. Crock a crock. Hasuian Sneasel. Pangrel. Nicket. Sand Isle, Nuts Leaf, all my dark types. I barely have 10, guys. But then we get into the other stuff. And I have way more, trust me. A double, very nice evolution, which I did not know he had evolution for the longest. Exodrill, Steel type, and the normals. Weird, out of place. Eevee, everyone loves Eevee, come on. A Q-Fent. Oh my goodness, these things are so strong. Single strike. Also, a steel type. Guys, this is so weird. Teddy Ursula. In the new game, no spoilers, this gets terastalatized into a grass type, which is just, just crazy. I don't understand it. But hey, Wooly Wool. Wool? The Wool? Another steel type. This is definitely an electric type. Take it tomorrow. Skitty. Chattertot. Rufflet. Wooly Wool. Indeed. Another Indeed. One of my favorite arts. I love the man who does this. Like, he has another one that Volpsor that I just saw. This background is beautiful. Anyways. Buffalo Ant. Swivel, Rufflet, Flesh Offender, Snorlax. I think that that's my only Steel types. Dragon types, definitely one of my first cards. Jachini, Drampa, Drampa, which was in the three pack of Pokemon uh, McDonald's. A Zoo Weasel, don't remember how to say his name. And a Dino. But I do not have Hydro Dragon. Okay, there we go. Hold on. You already saw these. It's not that deep. Balvin. Magnetite. Fearost. Four I don't know how to say his name. Whatever. A Propass. Oh my goodness. Do y'all see that? Terrible. Also one of my first Pokemon. Browns Bronzor. All my steels and dragon types. Let's go. And now we're into the fire types, which is the last time. And then we can finally get into my binder and quick stuff. And I have really a lot, a lot of trainers. Slugma, Ponyta, another slug. Oh, wait. Yeah, no, I'm going a little too fast. Slugma, 
Nice art right there. Slugma again. Ponyta, my only one. Very nice. Lilio, definitely one of my first cards. Let's go, Lilio fans. Growlithe. I don't know about Growlithe. He's a weird Pokemon, but his, he has a very nice evolution. Bulbix, I actually have an Alola in one of those. And with that, we are finally done with my Pokemon box. This. Then we're about to get on to the binder and other stuff, which are going to be quick going through. Stay hydrated. Stay hydrated. Stay positive. We're not done yet, though. So, um, yeah. So, about that Glaceon water type. Crazy, guys. Um, I feel like less every time I put these in here, I'm just ashamed. Just like, oh, look what I've done again today. But it's okay. Then put Clefairy in first. I meant Topeg. Oh my goodness, I said Clefairy. Sealed. On to the next thing. Let's go. After we went through that, which had nothing rare in it besides some regular rares, we have this. My only binder. Right now I'm getting another one. And... Oh, how I love this. I got this from a pack. It came with a booster pack and a coin, which is where I got one of the giant circle, like, silver ones that I just showed you. From Walmart, GameStop, anywhere. Pick these up. These are beautiful little things, pocket binders, all the types right there. How did Fairy get a type, but not ice? It doesn't matter. So, we're going to start off with some big bangers. The Dark War Turtle from last video. Oh, I'm still so hype about it. And then we get absolutely wrecked with this messed up Toxapec GX. Also, one of my first really creased. Lycan, I meant, yes, Lucario. Oh, my goodness. One of my favorite cards. I had a Rainbow Rare, but I lost it or I gave it away. Blastoise V, one of my also favorites. Leafeon GX. Now we're getting into the good stuff. Sylveon GX. Entei GX. And a Hoopa V, which I actually have the V card for. And boom! Hoopa V. See, it's moments like this. I was so happy when I got this. You should be grateful for everything. Small card. Big card. Small card. Big card. This actually might go in my binder front because I don't have a giant binder. A Neuvron V. Nice. Reggie Dragon V. This is all from Lost Origins. Starting from here. Reggie Rajan V. Or Reggie Dragon V. Then, Trupoleon V Max. Single Break. Single, single strike. Oh my. Drapion V. Very nice art. We have a stop here for what's next. Do you see that golden and black Rayquaza V Max Rapid Strike from Lost Origins? The one and only. Oh, look at this corner. This is such a beautiful card. I was so happy when I pulled this. And next we have something to just randomly follow them up. A... Oh, Master V. Nice trainer. A full art. Bre breaks in. Breaks in. I don't know how to say her name. Then a Bantini. Next is a Charizard. Let's go, guys. I have a Charizard. Then next we have another icon. Pikachu. Then we come into a... Oh, my goodness. Are y'all ready? Look at that. Eh. I can't even say the name. Azorak. V-Star. Absolutely beautiful. Asylian. Drapion V. A different form. Which I also got. What? Asylian. Ludra. V. Magnezone V. Very nice card. That was actually my last pull from Lost Origins because I ran out of packs. Alolan Gollum GX, which I actually just got recently. I also like a mustache. I also have a big 
break. And then we go into like random hollows, which I also have more of. So we have a bronzer hollow. I mean, um, not a hollow. Can't remember what they call it. What they call it? Regular wear spirit bomb. I will remember what these are called. Like unity. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Choi. Look at that. I have an entire like little thing. Galarian Maltres. Maltres. Galarian Zapdos. Galarian Articuno. Articuno is one of my favorite Pokemon. Cause like who doesn't like Articuno? Like he's wearing a mask and everything. Then we go into a Norvine. A Norvron. A Keldo. A hollow Articuno. That. Oh my goodness. Radiant Jirachi. Do you see that? Hollow and, um, I will remember the name. Hollow. I know what hollows are, but I can't remember what the other one is. Gold Box of Disaster. My only gold card. I loved it. Beside the Rayquaza. A another Articuno, which is a water type. They don't have flying types either. That's what it was. They he's not a water type. He I mean he is. Oh, you guys can't see that, can you? Sharpedo Radiant Alakazam. Hold on, let's put some light on it. Oh yeah. Look at that baby. Radiant Alakazam. Beautiful. What is next will shock you so I have four Radiant cards. Radiant Steelix. Radiant Steelix. He's gold. He's beautiful. Hasilian Bravery. And at the very back, a Hollow Zurok. That will conclude this little binder here. I meant this little pocket thing. Very nice cards. Hollows. Can't remember their names. I just can't right now. They're like these... And bruh, it doesn't matter. I just have them in like actual like binder things. I don't have a binder for them yet. I'm currently getting one. Okay. Electric Strike. Rosalita. Bonnet. I also have these ones. He has like these really cool things. I love those. Panini. She went. Another Panini. Hasuian Zora. Then we get it. These are just like random ones. Galarian Sturfetch. Boyo. Hollow Vatini. Hollow Detective Pikachu Jigglypuff. A Rapid Strike Starmie. Very nice. Then we go into a Hasuian Hollow. You see like the little glitter? And then a, oh wait, I didn't say his name. A sewing and basketball, basketball. And then I have another Vitini. I have two Vitinis. I don't remember where I got this. A hollow Vitini and a Slugma. I'm thinking of the other name. Because I might remember it halfway through the video. It's not hollows. Ten cards? Ten foil cards? I don't, I don't know, guys. You got to. You gotta help me out in the comics because I'm gonna get grilled. We have a Finion, Finion, and Arkin, Politoed, Bufflant. In Pokemon Go, this is a New York exclusive. If you would like to see some, some pop, excuse me for my non words, you know, you know what I mean. We have a Chandler, fire type hollow. Um, then we have a Medchamp, Machamp, Medchamp, Medchan. Um, one second. A Medchan, if you couldn't see that yet. A Medchan. Um, a Lost City. Colorless experiment. 
<sighs> Whew, gotta take a breath. We have Spectator, Hollow, Cherot, whatever this is, Toucan, one of my also other first cards, another Galgar, which is also a fighting type, one of these. Hollows, no, a Rumbolian Hollow, which I said I have. Then I have a Dot Dotler, Skunky, Hasilian, Sneasel, Sneasel, Sneasel. I'm gonna add uh, Sneasel. Anyways, that's random. Ariados, Snorlax, Pikachu, Hollow, and a Junko. Back, we have a Lollipop, Gloss of Flower. Smeargle Hollow, Pikachu Hollow, which I cannot also no, those were from the um McDonald's packs as well. Low bunny for all of you simps, look at her. Admire the greatness of Low Bunny. Clink. Machomp. Dolphin. Oh my goodness, the Great Tusk and Iron Tusk are beautiful. Y'all are gonna see me play um Pokemon Scarlet and Violet. Y'all want me to. Another cartoon ghastly. That's what it looks like. It looks like from the cartoons. Then I have a Archidops, Archidops, which is the evolved form of the other one that I just showed you. And it's a hollow. Then we have a hollow uh, crowbat. And that will be it for my little binder, hollows, and other things. Because I cannot remember the names. And then just for this section now, I'm going to go ahead and like show them off they're not like actual anything good they're just like actual cards a lost origin box these are all the packs opened up um nicely organized oh they got stuff on them yes this this is lost origin messed up the box a tad bit hasuian zuark right there and i have it then we have a, yeah, point is, Lost Origin, Sword and Shield. We will be completing the set soon, somewhere on the channel. And that is the tour. Oh, wait, I have some random other cards down here. I have three. This is a Polysand, Fighting type. Polywhirl, I love that art. Look how cool that is. And then a Hollow Classifier. Well, for my setup and other um, parts of the video, that will be all. Have a poke positive. Have a yeah. Have a poke positive day, and um, stay positive. Make sure to take care of yourself this week, um, week, month, whatever it is for you guys. Um, different times. Just be positive. And this is Razor Pug signing out. Bye, guys.